SBFalcons.com here with uh, tonight's hero, Ian Adams, in the season opening 1 0 overtime victory over Cal Baptist. Uh, Ian, your thoughts on the game? Uh, it was a long game, a very long game, and uh, I thought we fought really hard. And you could tell we were getting our first game jitters out, and uh, I think they were too, but definitely two very good teams. And I, as you can tell, we, uh, we fought right till the end. Well, the shot count was 10 to 6, but uh, you had more shots on goal. They had just one. But what were you feeling after kind of controlling the game, but still being tied after 90 minutes? Yeah, it was it was a uh, it was tough because I mean we were only four shots ahead of them, I mean, 10 to six. But it felt as though we were in their half um, more, and so we had more dangerous opportunities. But anything can happen in games, and you know they won breakaway and they could score. So it was very it was very back and forth, and I think that 90 minutes it could have gone either way. So. It was tough being tied. Well, three minutes and 13 seconds into the overtime, you netted the golden goal. Uh, talk about the build-up to that play and what happened on the goal. Yeah, so we actually talked about it right after uh, the 90-minute mark. We were talking about uh, how we need to create space for for somebody to flick it on, and so uh, we kind of created some space by having some guys check to the ball, and then Bryson, uh, a little nickname we have for him is Bentner, and he uh, flicked the ball on far post, and I was just there, and right place, right time. That's all, all it was. At what point, where are you? Danny Oliva started with a throw-in. Where are you on that play, and how do you end up by that right post? Yeah, I started I started far post, and I kind of drifted um, away so I could create some space. And then once I saw him, uh, he was going to win the header, and I, he flicked it. I made my way as, as quickly as possible to that far post and was there, luckily. What's your thought process? Do you see a ball falling in front of you near the right post? What are you thinking, and, and what did you do with the ball there? Honestly, I'm thinking don't miss. But I saw the keeper coming across, and I knew... Uh, he was probably quick enough to get there, so I knew I needed to put it away as quick as possible. So, uh, Where would this rank among your uh, goals at SBU? Well, I think I've only had about six goals in my career, and uh, I had a couple good ones freshman year, but I would say it's probably three or four, third or fourth, yeah. So not bad, especially being in overtime, it, it was good. Sure is. Uh, the magnitude of this one was big. This right. is your season opener. How important was it for this team, your eighth rank, to, to start with a win? Right. It's it's really big because, I mean, it's non-conference, and as we know, these, these matter the most. And I think that starting off with a win was important for the guys just to build confidence and to, to kind of get our season rolling. And now we're, uh, we're headed in the right direction. Well, the 1-0 win wouldn't have been possible without some great defense. Let's talk about your defense and keep the Cody Lang. So strong. They're, they're unbelievable. I mean, uh, they kept... Six shots, but I felt maybe two or three were dangerous and uh, not many great opportunities, and that had a lot to do about our defense, and they kept us in the game. So, I mean, without them, we wouldn't have even had that chance in the in the 93rd minute. You're back here at Interbase Stadium, 7 o'clock Saturday night against Chico State. Uh, what does the team have to do to, to kind of recover from this and get back and have a good outing Saturday? We really need to rejuvenate our bodies. I mean... 93 minutes is not easy on anyone, and so coming back and, and playing a team that's going to be fresh, and it'll be hard, but I think we're ready for it, and I think that uh, Chico is one that we have a, a little history with, and we're ready to, to show them what we're made of this year, so it'll be good. Thanks so much, Ian, and congratulations on the Golden Goal. Thank you.